What's up? I'm Troubleshoot. Welcome back to another video. In this quick guide, I'll be showing you how to reset your settings for Modern Warfare 3, Warzone 2, or Modern Warfare 3 Zombies. You don't need to be able to start up the game in order to undo settings changes or reset your graphics options, so this is a very good fix if you can't actually start up the game at all. All you need to do is hit Start and E at the same time, so the flag key on your keyboard and E, which will open up a new file browser. Head into Documents, otherwise C uses your username Documents, and we'll be looking for Call of Duty. Inside of the Call of Duty folder, you'll find a Players folder. You can ignore this one. It looks something like this. Open the Players folder, and inside of here, you'll see your currently active settings. So, Options.Battle Royale 3, 4, which I assume is the Warzone 2, CP being Campaign, I think, or SP being Single Player, etc. All of these ones with dot .4 have to do with Modern Warfare 3, and dot .3 have to do with Modern Warfare 2. Anyways, for the most part, you'll either be finding the problematic options. So, for example, I don't know, Options 4 over here, so COD 23. You can open it with any text editor and edit these options to your liking, whether it's maybe something to do with vSync causing a crash or along those lines, you'll be able to adjust a lot of the options here. And on top of this, options specifically for Warzone, multiplayer, single player, etc., all by customizing these files here. These folders with long numbers and letters and things like that are, I assume, your cloud backup versions for Steam and other platforms as well. Essentially, once you either edit these files here to fix whatever changes are causing issues, um, also the config file here, you can save and you should hopefully be able to fire up the game if you found the problematic option. Otherwise, simply select these files and either delete them or move them to a different folder. That way, your settings will be completely reset the next time you fire up the game. On top of this, if you find that the next time you open the game, your settings are simply overwritten, locate one of these files that's causing the problem. For example, options four, we can right-click properties and inside of here on the general tab, just tick read only, apply and OK. When you do so, the next time the game fires, up, it won't be able to modify this file here. Just keep in mind, when you change settings in-game, they won't be persistent, as in throughout restarts. You'll need to unlock this file by right-click, Properties, and unchecking Read Only, Apply OK, in order to edit and save your new settings. Anyways, hopefully you found this video useful. Thank you for watching. My name's been Troubleshoot, and I'll see you all next time. Ciao!